Hi there, my name is Lukas, and in today's tutorial, I will show you how you can use or customize shortcuts in order to improve your efficiency or speed of using the old plan. Let's say you are pushed by the deadline from your tutor or from your client. The best thing to improve your speed in design and drawing is using a shortcut instead of cruising around with the mouse and trying to find the functions which sometimes you forget where they are but you need to use them. When we look around and stay on a few functions, we can see that certain functions have certain shortcuts. For example, stretch entities, shift control P. But for example, split surface elements doesn't have. It's all up to our plan which functions you may use frequently and which don't. Then, for example, zoom all, F5. Instead of moving here, clicking icon zoom all, you can just simply press F5 and it does the same job. And it's way quicker. Next thing, for example, we come to wall, Control W. So let's try it. We press Control W and automatically the wall function starts. We can start drawing a wall without even thinking where we can find the wall tool. Then, let's say, we want to move the wall. But we are, for example, in modeling area. And as you can see, some of the functions are smaller or they are on a bit different place. So you are not quite sure where they are sometimes. So instead of thinking where the function can be, you can use a shortcut. But right now, Move Tool doesn't have a shortcut. What do we do? We come to the settings and click on the shortcut. As you can see, the window which all the functions and shortcuts are open. Once you are clicking through the library of all the elements and functions, you can see that some of the functions have their shortcut, but some of them don't. Right now, I'm in Edit Library, and here is a Move tool without a shortcut. When I click on it, I can simply insert a shortcut I'm used to use. But for example, right now, as you can see, Ctrl Shift M is taken for Modify Format Properties. I don't really mind, because for Modify Format Properties, I'd rather use Ctrl M. So I save yes, I want to change this shortcut. And then, in the, using Search tool, I can find particular function, Modify Format Properties, Let's say I assign it to control M. But this is assigned to some function I've never used in all plan. You may probably use it, but me personally I haven't. So I don't really mind overwriting this function without knowing what it does. Click yes, because I know that I will use this function way more frequently than the function that control M was assigned before. Once I'm happy, I click save. And for example, right now, without going up, move tool, and I don't know, whatever, I click Ctrl Shift M and I can simply move the wall. Or for example, right now the wall is drawn, I need to assign the dimensions to it. So instead of coming again here, I can see dimension has no shortcut. So I go again to the options, Shortcut. Now I know the dimension is in dimensions, dimension line, and let's say Control D. It's assigned to navigation mode. I can rewrite it because I want to use Control D as dimension line. It's more efficient for me. So I overwrite it, click save. Now I use shortcut Control D, and I can really quickly use my dimension lines in order to show the thickness of the wall or the length of the wall without 
going up or maybe I'm in the modeling tool here is no dimension line and um, I need to go back to either element or design and find it so I simply use Control D again use vertical and I draw a dimension line without any problem once you let's say completely redesigned shortcuts for your all plan and you don't want to lose these settings what you can do is come back to shortcuts and you can export the settings in the shc file so you can name it shortcut tutorial it will be on the desktop i click save and next time when we install let's say all planned on your laptop or on your computer. You can simply just import the very same file with shortcuts and all of your shortcuts are loaded back to your all plan without any problem. You just simply click save, all is saved, load it into all plan and then you can simply use all plan in the way you usually like. Thank you for your attention and see you in the next video. Bye bye.